A Girl Named Pearl, audio version by P.G. Barnett. Years ago, when the West was young and the law was ruled by gun, there lived a girl and her name was Pearl, and she grew up hard but with no regard, cause Pearl she had the sharpest tongue, left many a man undone. Now Pearl she was a friend of mine, together we would hunt. Her aim it was her claim to fame, that Pearl she'd hit I must admit a bull's eye every time, and all beasts we would confront. I still recall that day so well, upon that mountain plain. We tarried long, then all went wrong. My horse, old blue, she threw a shoe, and then our day was shot to hell when it began to rain. So me and Pearl, we looked around for cover from the storm, and found a cave, but Pearl was brave. She started in without a whim, and then I heard a frightening swarm of growls and snarls profound. The sounds of gunfire echoed out. I yelled at Pearl to run, but Pearl, I found, did stand her ground. She kept on firing without tiring. Pearl went at them with her gun. Then quietness settled about. I feared the worst had come that day, imagining in my head. Brave Pearl had lost, her life it cost. She valiantly fought, but all for naught. I prayed, dear Pearl, she wasn't dead, but I'd have to look to say. I stepped inside and there was Pearl, and round her lay the five. Big mountain cats, the biggest that I'd ever seen. It was quite the scene, and though dear Pearl was still alive, she stood amazed at what unfurled. She finally looked at me and smiled. I grinned at her and said, Pearl, my friend, you did them in. Pearl nodded and frowned, and then she stared at the ground, then sighed with a shake of her head. So next time is yours, and I hope you endure the next cave we choose to defile.